uh, one of the first ways to really kind of get politicized here in America um, before 9-11, you know, understanding the Palestinian struggle, uh, the struggle for freedom and for justice and equality, uh, a struggle that has really in many ways become a metaphor for so many other struggles around the world. Um, and that's why you hear uh, some of the most important uh, anti-apartheid activists, Desmond Tutu and Nelson Mandela, showing their so solidarity with Palestinians. Uh, that's why you hear, um, you know, Gandhi even in some of his early writings and uh, Malcolm X and so many others, countless others, talking about and, and framing the, the Palestinian conflict within this lens of uh, really basic uh, injustice and, and, and a desire to kind of see dignity and humanity um, being brought forth for the Palestinian people. And so, you know, that was uh, kind of how it was introduced to me and how I ended up carrying it through in, in my own work uh, as an MC and as an artist uh, who was inspired by Palestinian poets like Mahmoud Darwish and uh, Arabic music and culture and you know so all of that kind of infused into uh, who I am and as, uh, as a person and as an artist and as a, an activist.